Kalokan from Camden Town, we have a can of their to the pub American Pale Ale coming in at 4% ABV. Now, I was actually surprised this morning. Um, there was a delivery at my door, and the good guys of Camden Town sent me some cans of this and some merchandise for the pub shed. And yeah, so I thought I'd better review this straight away. Now, the good thing about this beer is all the proceeds from this beer um, are going to all the small little pubs out there to try and help them get back on their feet. Camden wants to wants to put this money into supporting their local pubs to make sure they don't close down and Weatherspoons get the monopoly on the market and all that. So, look, you know, I don't know about anyone else who's going down the pub tonight because I'm going down the pub tonight I'm going down the local but for those of you that are maybe not going down the local you still want to self-isolate from things like that look go on Camden's website pick yourself up some cans of this you're basically getting six cans for 13 pound right they're 500 mil cans as well so look go pick yourself up six cans and if you feel that you can't go down your local pub to, su to support them tonight and to help them out because you want to self-isolate click on Camden's website pick yourself up six cans and support them that way just give them a, you know, a couple of quid or whatever the proceeds are going to it that way you know help them out that way you know and hopefully we can we cannot lose our local pubs so without further ado let's crack this this bad boy open get it into a glass and give it a review Look at that beauty in the glass. Absolutely looks cracking. It's a lovely pale golden colour. There's a slight haziness there, but not a lot. Look at the carbonation though. Look at the carbonation in that glass. And this is a non-nucleated glass. So this is purely the carbonation in the beer. It's got a beautiful three to four finger white tight frothy foam head let's get the aromas oh my god it smells fruity oh it just smells divine tropical fruits I could just if this was a if this was an air freshener for your car I think you would die and go to heaven you can smell it's got the, 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 the citra hops in this the grapefruit the citrus you're getting there's a lot of malts in this beer as well so you're getting a lot of malt at the back end of the of the aroma oh it smells divine i've got to dive in so cheers this brings a smile to my face and the reason this brings a smile to my face is the back end of this is very sort of Vienna Pilsner, Vienna Lager. It's the first thing I've just picked out of this beer. It's very sort of influenced by the sort of Vienna Lager, Vienna Pilsner at the back end. There's a fruitiness to this beer. There's a sweetness, a bitterness, a sweetness. And then you get sort of get this Vienna Pilsner Lager back end, which sets this beer 
differently. It's got a lovely, look at that lovely lacing on the glass. Now, believe it or not, <laughs> actually, you're getting a lot of beer for your money here. Um, when you think about it, six cans for 13 quid. That's just over, what's that? Uh, my maths is right, about, about 2 15 a can. Okay, £2.15 a can. What you got to think of? The kettle hops, they're using Pearl, Simcoe and Citra. And then dry hopping, they're using the Simcoe, the Syro and Idaho 7. So there's six hops in this beer. And then the malts, you've got, you've got your Pilsner, you've got your Crystal, you've got your Munich and you've got your Wheat. And there's four malts. That's a heck of a lot of ingredients in a beer. And this is only 4%. This is so drinkable, it's unbelievable. This is a great beer to have on a Friday or Saturday night. Fish and chip supper. Get your fish and chip supper from the chippy. Sit down, pour yourself a glass of this. You got your gherkin or your wally, depending on what part of the country you're from right you've got your fish and chips your gherkin your wally a can or a couple of cans of this i don't think life could get any better myself salt and vinegar fish and chips your pickled gherkin or wally and a couple of cans of this because this would complement fish and chips absolutely fantastic the quintessential English dish with the quintessential um, I know it's American pale ale but you know a, as we all know a pale ale goes nice with your fish and chips um, um, I like to go into the um, I don't know yourselves and, and, and Camden I'm sorry to say this right? um, <laughs> um, I like to go into like sometimes a shepherd neem pub and um there's actually one in Greenwich, Shepherd Dean Pub, right on the corner of the, the Greenwich Square. And they've got a fish and chip shop in the middle of the pub. And I'm not kidding you, when you walk in, because the doors are on the corner of the pub, you can go left or right into the bars, and straight in front of you is a fish and chip shop. And many a time when I've been to Greenwich, I've sat down there, and we've, we've been on a Sunday, I like to go on a Sunday down to Greenwich, park at park at the um the museum um the royal naval museum they got there um park there walk down to the square at lunchtime go into the shepherd neen pub i forgot the name of it but it's on the corner and uh get myself a nice nice um fish and chips for lunch on a sunday and uh to have a, 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 a um shepherd neen or a, 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 a whitstable bay pile ale and to have a lovely pile ale with my fish and chips absolutely fantastic and this this will be a brahma to have your fish and chips so look those of you who are going down the pub or have been down the pub today fair play to you um, I hope you supported our little small, your local pubs and not your Weber Spoons. Those of you who are still going to self-isolate and think you're not going to go down to pubs for a while, look, get on the Camden's, Camden Brewery's website, nail yourself six of these, right, and perhaps next Friday night or Saturday night, have some of these with your fish and chip supper. So look, get all this beer, try it. It's absolutely fantastic. I, I can't praise it up enough. And, I, and you think I'm not a sort of person who likes the low ABV beers. So come on, it's 4% and I'm praising it up. And it's not because Camden have given it to me for nothing. Um, this is a great tasting beer. It's tasty. Um, would I buy it again? Yes, I would. Um, I might be tempted to actually go on Camden's website and buy another six more. It's, it's that good beer. So. Look, um, get now yourself six cans, 
try and see what you think leave a comment below give us a big thumbs up if you like the view hit that little bell get notified every time i bring out a new one and of course subscribe to the channel and like i always say beer is the answer but i cannot remember the question thank you for watching good night TT says, never play with matches, fireworks, and always drink responsibly.